I smell the Friday morning aroma of my wife Joelle lovingly making the challah. Hey! <laughs> Hi! I couldn't resist. Hi, then. Okay, tell good morning. The making of challah is a very special thing in, in Jewish life, to, especially in modern times, because the challah which we eat on Friday night and on Saturday, and that really is a, a, a cornerstone of the Shabbat meal. Challah for us represents not just a material food sustenance to our body, bread, uh, which is the staple of life, but it's more for us the love and the holiness that is put into making that challah. We start with flour. In the flour I put um, one teaspoon of salt. The salt represents some of the bitterness that we have to go through in life. I put one cup of water. Okay, one cup of water. Water, of course, represents life. First, I put the water and the, uh, the yeast in the water. Okay. I mixed all the wet ingredients together. So okay. that was in, instead of sugar. Oh, you didn't do the sugar yet. Okay, I see there's sugar. <laughs> I put, instead of sugar, I put a half a cup of honey. Oh, this is a real uh, healthy challah. <laughs> then there's oil. Oh, did I forget the oil? Yes. I put in olive oil. In this olive thing. oil. Israel is known oil. for olive oil. Now we eat it? No. It looks different. <laughs> now I'm going to cover it with a cloth and okay. put it in a nice warm place and let it rise. There's my dough. I like to make a four braided hala. So I'm going to cut this into four. After it's finished sitting, I'll brush it with some egg and put it in the oven for about 30 minutes at 350. Shabbat Shalom! Shabbat Shalom!